Retail, my man. How are you? Good, you, man. I'm all good, I'm all good. What's up? So, introduce yourself to us. Uh, to you or to the people? <laughs> to me and to the conkers. <laughs> <laughs> to you and to the conkers. Yeah. Um, let's see, good afternoon, conkers. Um, I go by the name Tepot Simung. Um, owner, founder, CEO. Yeah, mastermind behind TTQ Pro chili sauces in a nutshell that's the that's the summarized intro and there is of course oh it's broad bro <laughs> the whole business is broad but then I'll, I'll just break down the chili one because that's that's where it actually started bro. um the chili no i wasn't actually i am selling chili ttq pro chili sauce it's not just chili sauce but it's ttq pro sauces but it all, it all started with the chili sauce. Yeah, so for me to get to the chili sauce, it, it started with the love I have for chili. And then I can compromise. I get it in your I can't eat powdered chili because of the capsaicin in the more the powdered chili. It um it is step malaga very quickly. But yeah, I, I've only been using what four or five now. Um, the regular chili, just to break it down, that people know. It's not that heated. And then you go up. There's bits. I there's there's cayenne. There's habanero. There's Carolina Reaper. There's Trinidad scorpion. There's chocolate. There's a whole array of chilies, lo- lo- locally and internationally. But for no momzanzi difficult as it may be i'm only able to get to carolina river the height of it and it's very hard to find but that's that's where it, 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 it that's where it differs yeah. yeah and then but now the powder chili that we buy go to shopping we don't even know what which chili is it that is why okra cayenne cayenne chili and then okra peri peri so the cayenne at least you know it's cayenne but what about everything else? How to You just know you just know the chili powder and then what's hella what. So now the way it's being processed was a problem for me. Because it's burning some up very quickly. So um 2006 when I got into the industry, uh, officially professionally at a at a, at a hotel school, Elonghore, it's it's known. Um Sita approves, like you know, that's when I figured out I need to start making my own sauce in order for me to continue eating food because so and then I was like, okay, let me start doing my own chili sauce. And uh, brah, I'll tell you that's how long the journey took from 2006 up until 2020 when I eventually finally got the the recipe that I'm working with right now. <laughs> TTQ was an entertainer. TTQ was a love of music. Still is. Hence sometimes I get booked to DJ and select on for the Sunday sessions, which I still do, but TTQ was a performer. A singer, a dancer. Hard to believe, I know. People will look at me like, okay, go chaiva. Yeah, but um, I used to be that person. If you go back into my history, uh, primary and high school, but I'll try to get it still. What chaiva? Why actor? Why tang? And I did it very, very properly. Proper. You know, so before that I was entertainer, music lover, and all of that, and then, boom! High school, I decided to take on hotel keeping and catering. Go grade nine. Oh, well, I wanted to choose any subject. The more hotel keeping and catering, travel and tourism, geography, all the business economics, and all of those subjects. They are combined into one, and I studied that all through high school. Um, 
which I completed my school very long ago. I get all the lore. Jarifing. Disclaimer. Disclaimer. It's long exposed. Long exposed. So and then, 2000 and something, I completed my metric, and then 2006, um, I started my journey of being a professional chef. Go Harangua Hotel School. Yeah. When 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 I got to hotel school, ne? Yeah. The nice thing about our school was they gave each and every one of us an opportunity to learn all departments. But based on that, I want everyone wanted to run to hot kitchen. And but there's still gallery. There's still uh, waitressing, there's still a barman. So basically, in that industry alone, there's so many departments that you can go to that everyone was choosing hot kitchen, hot kitchen, because that's where the main meals are. Yeah. Yeah, everyone wants to make the better stew. You know, everyone wants to make the dopest goulash. You know what I'm saying? Okay, it's still stew, but it's a different kind of stew. Ah, <laughs> man, I'm not, it's, it's, it's not that deep, it's not that deep, dog. Ah. It's just felt like Shit, beef stew, the beef goulash. Yeah. I am going to tomato paste it with you. I'm like, come on, dog. Ah, come on, come on. I haven't made goulash in flipping yeah. 16 years. That's how, that's how easy it is, and I haven't made it still. So, so most of us, but when we skiller, we wanted to hot kitchen, hot kitchen, hot kitchen. And that alone rendered the industry to be very small in the sense of everyone wants to be a hot kitchen chef. What about the other section? Yeah. Oh, well. So, me getting down to the industry 2007, 2008, I was doing all those other sections, except for pastry, pastry, because it's science small. Hey, measurements of small of that, or of big of that. Hey, 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 hey. So, I know, majority of us look at t-shirt, pastry, pastry, no lies. If you look at okay, let's say in 2006, 2007, Go to school, go to the store, 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 go to the Never seen Malumaga Baker, never seen Tamal Baker, never, none of that. So we grew up in the store, to the store. So we ran away from that. And then we went hot, went hot. And then I don't know, something in me just tweaked to say, man, ladies chef to buy a teddy battle with a hot kitchen. There's a department more kitchen cold section where they do salads, soups, sauces. You see, you see, you see where I'm going with this? Okay. <laughs> you see where I'm going with this? That 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 section in the kitchen where they do all of those starters, hors d'oeuvres, uh, amush bushes. The bite size, the, the finer things, the D2R. There's that section. And then I can tell you now, still for free, not a lot of men are in that section. The same thing that causes a lot of women to be in pastry. And not a lot of men in pastry. Thank you. <laughs> You're getting it now. So I got there because that thing out okay shop. Not a lot of people are in there because everyone is once hot, 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 hot kitchen, hot kitchen. Everyone wants to be a hot kitchen chef, do the main courses, you know, because people love main courses. Everyone wants to do that. I know how to do main courses, I know how to do hot section. But now, no one is in cold. My jita, very few. I know Chef David, Dilish Chef Temba, I think were the first two meals. And it was Panako, Galaga Estate, in Midland, when I was doing my training in 2006. Cold kitchen chefs, I think that's where it actually kicked in. Hey, level hot kitchen, and it was peace and quiet when they were in that section. They one of they ran their section. No one was telling them anything. You know, they they had to they reported to the executive chef, aka Gordon, Chef Gordon Fraser. Much love to you. They reported to him, and but they ran their section, and I worked with them that side. Bali two hours or a couple of hours. Now I'm going to have a salad with some, with some, with some, with some. Keep it cool. And and the, 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 the discipline, yeah, boy. When it came to that section, 
understanding what at the end of the day before when, when people start eating they start with salads and starters so you have to be on on, on point so that's when i learned the most and i guess i jump and then making sauces and all of that you understand the vehicle is the sauce when i did dressing you understand that's where the love actually kicked in but i i didn't even realize it myself one time and then from more did cool section the next year Kavaya, and then i went i worked hard learning more about and it's still in fit lady that in your resources and whatnot but in the case actually source any powder or the kira gazeta good show boom and whatnot whatnot until you give one or okay shop i'm exposed more to the powder than to the sauce the powder and rikiwa and the span and whatnot. What about the extra sauce? Because fresh chili gala, everyone is eating it chopped, raw as it is. How, how, how about you go and send to 2006-2007 Yeah, I'm like, okay, I need to make sauce so I can eat. For me, it was just about her cage because you'd, you'd get people as a chili say, and such a main cause why I'm like, nah, I can't. I need to have it in a sauce form. And then I started adopting the recipes. Uh, about to reading on recipes how to make chili sauces and I'd make I think I'm on my fifth recipe the one that I'm running with right now that you guys are enjoying that's my fifth recipe the other four not that they failed they were a step for me to learn or this is how it can be done properly it was a process bro, from 2007 2006 back then so imagine 14 years 14 whole years to get that proper recipe to 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 produce the sauce yeah. literally from just me wanting to eat <laughs> to <laughs> wanting to enjoy the food thing, <laughs> <laughs> no 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 i just loved the idea of chili sauce and me loving to eat food with chili and not the 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 the, 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 the idea of not being able to eat the powder yeah i think you're an push thing that inspired me to actually go and Go go down there, deep down, and then be like, okay, let me make my own sauce. You understand? So yeah, that's how we got to 2020 when I got the recipe. But it was literally it took me 14 years to get the recipe. Knowingly, unknowingly, the vision was there, bro. Unknowingly, I mean, like, how does one person get so committed into finding the perfect recipe to 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 a sauce without being motivated into doing something about it? Hence, get unknowingly, <laughs> the vision was there to eventually get to where I am right now, to getting it bottled. It's always been there, but unknowingly. Yo, yeah, but like, um, after producing it, the biggest challenge is getting the next person to trust you, to trust your product. Yeah. yeah that was the biggest challenge because it worked more even on the financial side of things um i remember my first production was literally i bought chili for 40 bucks and i produced it and it didn't cost me 40 bucks to produce because there's other ingredients going into that and the bottling of it and the storage of it the time the electricity to produce that first batch which was a two liter bottle and then having to bottle it and then after bottling it i can't buy it i don't even know how it tastes that is the trusting part you know getting that person to trust you into buying your product that is why the, the most difficult part of it all was getting people to trust you but I'm like, yo, sorry, ma'am, how are you doing? Sorry, sir, how are you doing? I'm selling chili sauce. Hi, are you TV? Everyone knows those big brands. I'll tell you this for free, man. Though those retail shops, they're in the plan, but far from where I am right now. Because I want to engage the Kasi market more than anything. Before I fit a cobble, but all about the the I got to do fit a cobble. They will come to me. You know what I'm saying? And one would look at it and be like, "Hey, but be careful, much cocky, much." No, it's not about cocky, much. I know when I 
go seek for them it's gonna be in their terms but if i make noise right at the ground i want you to know my brand i want the person of it and the know to know my brand you know i want i want i want it to be exposed more so so i want it to be exposed more more kasi and make revenue more kasi and grow more kasi and put that next boy in aspani wamokas before he can get exposed to the other person one time so with that uh, it's 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 a it's a competition but i'm not in competition you get what i'm saying because if i was in competition bruh i'll tell you since since i started the brand and the sources because the market was not open to a lot of people people were not aware with it yeah people were not aware with the market but now trust me there's a lot of people doing chili sauce and it's, it's 2024 i started 2020 it's four years me being in the market and they, people are are far 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 from where i am but still because I figured I'm not in a race, I'm in a marathon, bro. The, the long distance. But once you land, I. Ah, Joe. Ah, bra. Hey, director. DOP. Hey, you don't know this, bro. Like, I know what once it's done, it's going to be done clean. And, and shout out to all of the people that are coming into the market catch chili sauce because it's not easy. And then many of them are coming in short and then copy look because they're not going through the proper steps and stages. Ibali flop. Anton. Mutuasa regis after two years. After six months, hasa paisa because ucha kilo wabato ikenya marketing and then ufita marketing mutuara it nantu ya hao in Buddhist because you didn't follow the proper steps to get the right recipe. I'm not saying Horanayaka is the best, but it's the best. Because it took me all these years to find tuning to get it to, excuse me, to where it, where it is. And still, I'm in no rush. Always engage them. To, 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 to keep my customers, I always engage them. I, okay, to, um, <laughs> I, did, I didn't think uh, this marketing strategy was working. On my Facebook, every morning I, 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 I greet my, my clients. Yeah. No, good morning, TTQ Pro fam. Um, I hope you have a good day. Let's stay soft. Every morning. And until. I don't know. Out of nowhere, you just approach me. It's like, Jack, I see you. Like, what do you mean? It's like, I see you. The post is how getting one every morning, though. You wake up and you tell us good morning. And it was no fear to do it every morning. That will get you far. And I was like, oh, okay. So the, for me, I didn't know it would be that it would have that much of an impact. And to someone, I, I, some people I don't even know they they seeing it, but he literally came in. I see. You. How many other people are seeing it and I'm telling you? Understand? So it, it is part of marketing to keep on engaging your clients. Okay. That engagement, um, specials is a sourced up guy. Not yet. Not yet. Why? Not yet. And what is the purpose that you want to do so? The purpose is, is to, like, I want to invade every household, bruh. <laughs> I want to invade every household. Every household. And I haven't served that. I'm still working on that. Until, until everyone knows how my sauces taste. I haven't made it. If you haven't tasted it, I, I, I still have to get to you. I still have to serve you. If you don't, if you're not gonna taste it, I'd rather you speak about it. Okay, okay. You asked something similar earlier, and then I told you it's uh, engaging the people. Um, but uh, um, the most uh, important tool right now in business 
uh, even though what was say jambi or what saying to 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 hate social media it's 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 positive it's positive uh, even though honestly i think me engaging people personally as 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 did the most oh, well. but as far as reaching people is concerned um social media helps more understand because there's people that are in Limpopo right now but don't worry they know the brand people in Cape Town um, I've went as far as Bumalawi, Mozambique outside I think I've had like two hello mama the guy thing I've got like it's not more than 10 people in the US as well on that stand that have seen the post and you know um, it's it's, it's no lie. I mean, like, they can't just tell me what people in the US are viewing my profile for the sources. So I, I've reached more people with social media. But I feel it's, it's always better. I keep well one in person. Because social media can only tell you that part of what I'm posting and how I narrate the post. As opposed to when you see me in person and we speak about the sources, the passion comes out more. You know what I'm saying? Because I, 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 I am very passionate about the, 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 the sources, man. I love them. <laughs> I love them. It, 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 it instills growth, man, because we, we all eat. Understand? So the study of food in a sense of culinary arts makes it even more interesting. The presentation of it comes from the study culinary arts understand so it grows the mindset it's just as a means of sustenance as a need just to feed and bohore. now when it comes to the culinary arts of it then you, you make it even more enticing even more interesting and then comes the palate understand so me having studied i think i've got an upper edge in a sense of engaging and growing the mindset the motor fit and what the guys understand go 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 buy is a chili sauce but there's other brands that chili sauce but because i studied how to cook first and understand how ingredients can be incorporated into a certain sauce it makes it even more innovative like people fall in love with the idea of how did you get the TTQ? How did you manage to, you know? Because I get people telling me, your sauce is chili, but it still has flavor. It's not about just and then it's just heat. No, there's flavor. So having studied gave me that extra edge. And it, 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 it's engaging to people. People fall in love with that as well. Yeah. I'm more in touch with the people on the ground. You know, sometimes you want people to fall in love with your style of cooking, but how is about taking their palate and engaging your culinary edges to their style? You know what I'm saying? So I'm more about that, um, making people fall in love with my style of cooking, even though I'm doing what they already know to be what they love on top we, we've all grown knowing and loving chili and chili sauce but now i engage the people on the ground by making it even more tastier but still i'm one with them because i love it it's one thing getting such chili sauce but i don't even eat it people are like hey, when are the also eat over i'm like i'd eat <laughs> I did that because by the time the feet, my product would have been the tastiest that you can ever try on the market. Bah, my mom, my mom, my mom, my mom, the queen, Matsimun, Joe, hey, SS, hey, what are you about You just switched up there, man, because it, it, it was hard starting. And she's she's been there, you know. She's been there. Hell, she even buys, bruh. 
I always have to protect them like Mama Kiki and Chidi so I was like, okay, can I give a guy? I'm like, no, but you don't have to buy that. Give me nuggets I rig. Kid nugget to me, son. And then give me one feeling that idea or you can understand or if it business is our way, it's like when you're always giving. More especially to fair. Understand? You're the, the people closest to you. My mom. My mom has bought from day one. And I still give. So I'm like, if it's a fresh batch, it's what I give. Then she'd come and be like, can I give a guy? Because I'm like, I don't know how to do And uh, since the study and everything, she's been behind me. And then when the product came, she's the first one She's the first one that bought. Literally so. When I learned that I was going to wash her, but then she was the first one that bought. Matimu, Matimu has been there, bro. Yeah, my mom, bro. Family, family, go kawati, go kawata. Like the, the the truth is, um, they 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 are your biggest supporters, but still, if you're not careful, keep on about that one. Okay, let me one because they expecting more, expecting more. And then when you make the sales and you start making a little bit of money, they still want a piece of that pie, you know? So um, I'm just glad that my mom has always been there from day one. Um, my brother also buys, my brother also buys, my older sister still buys, you know? My cousins, some of them know of the products, some of them have bought. And um, I think I go all the level of buying. You don't fit in a good or bad buy. You understand? Because I was I was so big then. Bad fit. Ah, ah. By the time I regard it, I was still I was like next door neighbor. I go, yeah. When I was so, yeah, but my clean. My just clean, ba. Everyone is sourced. When I go, I don't fit in your fam. Oh, but then like you want product there, I so. But I, 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 I watch it, ha. And I appreciate them still. I appreciate all of you. You fam. On a Monday, the words of encouragement coming from the mayor now now post associated to my end that 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 means a lot, you know. It, yeah, you're motivated when all the motor and the brand how okay people see you and they still say we see you. You know, it means you you are engaging them. I'm here to engage their parents. Yeah. Yes. So hence I, I mentioned earlier Hore, I want to grow the Kasi market first. I I I I I I I love but what I said is you must I love street food, and I want them to be my clients first before I go and engage the person owning a retail shop, a big retail shop, because they are the ones that are gonna grow me and I'm gonna grow them. I I believe my sauce makes their food different, because there's 30 people selling pap and nyama, but if you're selling pap and nyama with TTQ true sauce then you stand out from the rest. So that collaborative part, I'm collaborating right now with a couple of Kasi businesses. Um, I don't know, it's okay, should I mention? Shapo. Ah, they, 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 they will come and conquer, definitely. I mean, like, we, we will talk to them to come through. I'm, I'm, I'm collaborating with a guy, Mo, 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 Deep Blue Zone 3, um, called uh, Tulani Lamlenze. Um, uh, um, chicken, half chicken, full chickens um, on weekends. I'm collaborating with some young boys, but I go the busy street, multi proof evening drive. I'm young, um, be in the name of the future. They're my clients as well, um, and I'm yet to, to, to conquer. Baba and because they, they, they understood the dream, they understood uh, where I want to get. You understand? And trust you, me, they, they, mobile in Lebanon, they come to me and say, If you talk about the product, people are not bad. We want the chicken, but they talk about the way, the way, the way. You understand? They talk about that way, the TTQ way. And for me, I, I, I stand proud, man. I'm like, Yo, they're soft, you know. They are officially soft. If they can't enjoy that quarter chicken with my chili, then definitely means it's more business for an Ekasi entrepreneur. Because people will leave six other 
chicken sellers just to go to you because you are sourced. Yes. Everyone sells chili, chili, chili sauced uh, chicken, but not with TTQ sauce. That's why, that's why I, I think I respect the collaborations more, you know. And we'll get there if it's too. Um, that's why I, I even mentioned or the hardest thing is people trusting you. Yeah. It helped me reach a lot more people. But, and um, sales wise, like I'm able to career to places whereby I don't even know the person. But I've engaged their parents. And they've seen me through social media. I'm born with TikTok, eh? I'm born with TikTok, eh? Um, they saw me on Instagram, they saw me on Facebook, they saw me on WhatsApp. You know what I'm saying? People I don't even know, they, they call and order. Because my number is there, it's public. I get, I'm not shy of sharing my number because I know that's how people will get to me. I've got a lot of contacts. Some I would say the question, eh? And they don't order, and it's fine. I've engaged someone. I know this guy, I've spoken to this guy, I've engaged this guy. The time will come, they will order. A discipline. It's, 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 it's the hardest thing to do in business, it's the hardest thing to do in food production. Consistency. It's a modi my discipline. Um, the one thing that I noticed, suppliers. If I get, if I've got seven suppliers, the product will not taste the same. The soil in its own sense, soil. If it's planted mojozi and I get it and people love it and I go and buy something, I go nothing. The soil is not the same. So the heat of the chili comes from there as well. I realize in the 14 plus years. A huge difference bro. we'll get to that but it's a very huge difference buying chili from the the the, the soil yako venda and buying chili from the soil yako fernache buying chili from the soil yako solito it's the same chili it's cayenne but muole aubele au khudi si chili le the two is full of potential omu omu ay khudi sebe chili ke harvest full growth and you get it from vendor where the soil is so rich and then if you come away then you get the best chili sauce ever shout out vendor my feet oh chili say hello my feet ah boy yeah my feet girl now your feet my feet is okay ha ha boy now your details but I'm excited 